welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber welcome back and thanks for being a loyal subby if you're not already go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below because we are on the road to 1k okay so go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click the bell notification right next to it so you can be notified every time i upload a new video so as we know Sadly, summer is coming to an end, but all good things must come to an end to bring new things into fruition. And of course, that means that fall is coming. So why not come to you all with a fall haul from our fave, Shein. Yes, I have a fall Shein haul for you guys and it's loaded with goodies, so keep watching. So the theme that I'm going for this year for fall is comfortability. I am not trying to be tight in anything this fall i just want to be comfortable loose casual but still cute you know so the first piece that i got was this tee here and it says chicago of course i had to get my chicago gear in because that's where i'm from it is in this really really pretty like camel color and oh my god i love this i've seen some shirts from shein before that had kind of like a polyester feel to it so i didn't know what to expect but this is a really really nice cotton it's made really well and the letters are kind of like this distressed look here so i really really love that i got this in a medium i usually wear a size medium so this is great i wanted it like an oversized fit but not super oversized and super baggy this is perfect for the look that i'm going for and I think it's gonna last the whole season. Now, I paired it with these high waist joggers, which are cinched at the ankle. I will say, um, these are a bit tighter than what I really wanted it to look like, but you know, they're not bad. They do still have a little looseness here at the ankle part. I got these in a medium as well. I probably should have sized up, so I suggest you to size up if you want a loose fitting jogger, but they're not tight at all. Um, they're just fitted and it does have pockets. The only thing, it does not have a drawstring here, but they are pretty secure and they will stay up the whole time you're wearing them. So I do love these. Um, out of all the things that I purchased today, I don't think anything just like not fit. So everything went well for me on this Shein haul and I'm super excited because you know that almost never happens but yeah let's keep going so the next thing I got was this bodysuit now let me tell you it's a little tight in the arms it is a little tight but you know I appreciate it because the fabric is really really nice I cannot complain about that this is a bodysuit so it is kind of high cut it comes all the way up here don't want to flash y'all but yeah, it comes all the way up. And I wouldn't say it's really thonged, but it's it's kind of, you know, medium coverage bodysuit. But I really do like it. It does have this zipper right here. It can kind of pair with anything. It's like a basic. So the zipper can zip all the way up if you want a mock neck look. Or you can zip it down. If you just want a little sexy, just give them a little bit of something, you know? So yeah, this top, if you get this, I would definitely size up i did get it in a medium but it's very very exact especially if you have a bigger arms definitely size up so i have paired it with these tie-dye joggers absolutely love these pants even in the comments everyone was saying oh my god love them best pair of pants that i own and they are not disappointing me with those reactions so yes get these they are so comfortable it has a drawstring which is really long so however wide your waist is it will definitely fit you they do have a little bagginess in here it's not super tight and it does scrunch at the ankle um i am 5'4 so i don't know if you're taller it will come up a little higher on your ankle but i actually love this length just how it is and this pattern is super duper cute they had a ton of colors to choose from but i just kind of want to stick with neutral colors this fall so like i already said i am going for a comfortable look this fall and i got these last pair of joggers here in this mint green color and i absolutely love it if you watch any of my other videos on fashion this year you know that green was my color that i was sticking to so i absolutely love these they're really really soft 
I also got these in a medium. They are um, like a fitted jogger. So if you do want more loose fit, you would definitely size up. They are really, really comfortable and stretchy. It does have a drawstring as well on these and it has pockets. So yeah, you can never have too many joggers because you know, you just wanna throw them on, go run your errands and not think about too much of being uncomfortable, but you're still cute, you know? You can get a little look in. <laughs> so this next top I was really debating on because I kinda have a top already similar to it. And I was like, eh, I don't know, but I went ahead and got it and I'm glad that I did. It's like this really, really cute cold shoulder top. So there's these cutouts here on the shoulder. The only thing I don't like about it is it is a little bit sheer, a little see-through as you can tell, but I do have a nude bra on with this. So I would definitely wear a black bra and it is kind of cropped. You really can't tell right now because I have one like some high-waisted jeans, but it is a bit cropped and it also is a little bit thin, but you know, it's nothing that's out of the ordinary. This is she in clothing. So all of their items are not like top, top quality, but it's not bad. You can get a few wears out of it. It is a rib knit. So I don't know. It's not gonna keep me super warm if it's cold outside, but it is kind of cute though. It's a nice chic little look. You can throw on a necklace, a cute pair of earrings, and you're good to go, girl, okay? So don't expect much out of this top, but it's giving. It's giving on the shoulder area. It's giving a little shoulder action, you know? <laughs> But I did get this one in a medium as well. It is really stretchy, so don't worry about the size, sizing down, sizing up, or anything. Get your normal size. So when I saw this bodysuit here, I knew I had to have it. First of all, it was the chains for me, okay? It was the chains for me. This is super cute. I was expecting it to be like, a really cheap chain but the chains are quality like it is a nice little metal it's not plasticky or cheapy or anything and the bodysuit itself does have excellent stretch like it really stretches overall this part um is not really the best at holding girls up so if you do have bigger boobs i would not suggest this top but um it doesn't really have much support here but if you like me uh, I'll say like a D cup or below, you're good. And it is mesh all the way around. In the back, it is mesh and it is a bodysuit, like I said. So yeah, this one is really cute if you wanna do a little night out, something simple, throw on a blazer or something over it, a little jacket, and you're good to go. So this top here, super, super baddie, like, oh my God, this is super, cute and it's really kind of like holding me in and giving me a figure giving me some boobs get, making me look like i got a little little boob job or whatever but i don't so <laughs> it's like this really really cute one shoulder top it crosses over here it has a little pickable slit right here and it's made like bustier like type right here so this little corset detailing here is really nice it does sense you in it is stretchy so um, yeah, don't worry about it being too tight. It's a nice cotton material. I love this material, it's really, really soft. Um, doesn't feel like the girls are going anywhere. You don't need like any kind of strapless bra or anything on with this. I did get this in a size medium, so this is my correct size. And I love it. I think it's the boning for me that just does it. Like this little, little part right here just kind of accentuates your hips, gives you a shape. So yeah, I definitely, definitely highly recommend this top here. You can like wear this going out. You can even throw on some gym shoes with this and step to wherever you gotta step to real quick. But it's your choice. Of course, I had to run it one more time with the Chicago gear. And I absolutely love this pullover sweater. It's super comfortable, y'all. Super, super comfortable, all right? And when I saw this, the first thing I thought about were my Gucci A sneakers. So this would be perfect for a look. Yes, definitely perfect for a Gucci moment. Um, they did have other colors on there. I think they had like a pink. 
They had brown, they had the black with the red, which would be really, really cute because, you know, the whole Jordan era and everything. I love it. It's not too short on the sleeves at all. Like, I can raise the sleeve. And it is still a great length. Now, if you do have long arms, you may have a problem. But for me, it's perfect. I did get this in a size small because I read the reviews. And everyone was saying how large this runs. So, if you want it, like, a comfortable oversized size fitting, um, I would definitely size down one size. Like I said, I do normally wear mediums. But this is a small. And this is definitely going to keep me warm. Definitely going to keep you warm. It's nice and thick, but not super duper thick, but it'll definitely do its job for real, for real. So this next top that I got is really a hoodie, um, but you can wear it as a top or you can just wear it as a hoodie on top of something. And it has this asymmetrical design here that's still going for that corset, bustier type look, but it doesn't have any boning here. It's just stitching that goes and gives the illusion. It does have drawstrings on the hoodie part. Um, it is kind of tight though. <laughs> that is what I will say. This is in a medium, but it is very, very snug. So if you want this to be a little roomy on you, I would say size up for sure. Also, the sleeves are not like, they don't come all the way to your wrist. But hey, if you're a person that likes to you know, wear your sleeves up, that wouldn't bother you much anyways. But if you do want to wear them down, just please be advised that the wrists are short on this jacket. But overall, I think it gives a really, really good shape. It's kind of cute. You do, Like I said, you do not have to wear a top under this if you don't want to. If you just want to throw it on for a cute little look, you can do that. Or you can wear something underneath. You can wear like a little cami. But I don't think I have much room to do that because this is kind of tight, girl. This jacket a little tight. <laughs> but, you know, I'll make it work. It's not bad. So this is by far one of my favorite purchases out of this whole haul. It is this two-piece set. And the top is a hoodie. And it has, like, this cutout detail on the side. So it's longer in the front and longer in the back. And it comes with the matching leggings. This set fits a amazing okay it has super duper stretch i did get a large just because i was a little scared you know i got a little junk in my trunk back here so i was a little scared that it would be too tight but honestly i could have done the medium but i really do like the large it fits really really well so i'm not complaining about that and the material is really really of great quality so i'm definitely not complaining about this one the arms are definitely long enough Oh, this is amazing. This is definitely one of those throw on and do your errands, your run around type outfits. It does come all the way down to the ankle. So it is a full pants. It's not like a capri pants or anything. <sighs> Absolutely love this. If you don't get anything else from this haul, definitely get this set, okay? Cause it, it's giving, it is giving. It's so effortless and I love this. Now, I will say there are no drawstrings on the hood part, which, you know, it doesn't bother me too much. But, hey, if you're a person that likes drawstrings, there are none there. And there are no pockets or anything on the leggings. The next item I got is this bomber jacket. And I can say it is a little bit tight as well. Even though I did size up and I got a large in this, it's very, very exact. So, if you have bigger arms not gonna work for you i'm not sure what size this jacket goes up to but you know if i wear this i would just wear it open i wouldn't wear it closed like this because it is kind of i don't know it's kind of suffocating i don't like that you know i don't like it when it's tight in the arm so much i like it a little more loose which is why i got a large but apparently that didn't do too much for me <laughs> but you know i can work with it i can work with it just for a light little throw on jacket I think it'll work. It has like no stretch to it. So don't expect this to stretch a little bit. It does have stretch in the waist part, but not too much. But you know, I love this little olive green color for the fall. You know, that is one of the staple colors that you can have. So I'm not mad at it. Another thing you can't have too many of for the fall is a denim jacket. And I got this jacket here in a medium. 
I kind of wish I sized up and got a large, but I was listening to comments and people were like, oh no, it's, it's a great fit at your size, but I kind of should have got a, a large because I just like my denim jackets a little bit larger. Like I can close it, but it will be extremely tight. So if you want an oversized fit, I would definitely size up on this jacket. And the only downside is, I know you hear that, the little tinkling of the buttons because these buttons are like plastic. Don't like that at all, but you know, I'll get through it. If I'm just going somewhere where I don't have to hear that all night, I'll be good. <laughs> if I'm just throwing it on and go, you know, but otherwise, this gonna get on your nerves. I'm gonna let you know right now. But it is a very well made denim jacket overall. And even if you wanna put some patches on it or something, it will be really, really cute. And with the sleeves rolled down, it definitely will be really, really short. So it's not long arm friendly at all, which is why I have them rolled up in the first place. So don't expect this to be a full length jacket. But if you're like me and you like to roll them up, it is perfect for you. So this is the last clothing item that I got out of this haul. And it is the thing that I am most excited about. It is this little teddy coat. I've been wanting a teddy coat or a teddy jacket for a year after a year now, and I finally got me one. I don't know if I just waited too late every season to try to get one, but your girl got her a teddy coat this time. And I think I'm gonna go back and get a brown one because this is so luxurious. Like, I feel like you can throw this on, even with this, like, you can dress it down, dress it up. You can be cute with it. I love this. The only downside to this one is it does not have any pockets. You can close it on either side. So you can close it on this side here. And this is what it looks like closed. But there are no pockets. I think that's really going to irritate me that there are no pockets. But honestly, I would just leave this jacket open so I can show whatever outfit I have on. I think the, the arms are pretty accommodating for the length. And I did get this in a size small, so I sized down on this because everyone in the comments was saying that this jacket was really, really big, but I love it. It's still oversized and this is a size small. So depending on how you want to wear it, if you want a super, super luxurious Sex in the City type oversized size, stick to your normal size. But if not, you can size down. And it comes all the way like past my calves, not all the way to my ankle, but like mid calf and i think this is super chic and super cute every it girl needs her a teddy coat so <laughs> definitely grab this one now what's a good comfy fall without some baseball caps not every day is going to be a great hair day some days are just a little worse than others so I picked up this little cap here and I got it in five different colors. I got it in this chocolate brown here. I got it in like this khaki tan color. Got it in white, army green, and I got it in black as well. And they were only like $2 a piece. So I figured why not get five of them? The only thing about it, it has like a really, really bad smell. So I'm gonna have to like wash these first or something because smell is really bad or let them air out first but they are really cute they are adjustable in the back with the velcro and i think it's like big head friendly because it's like a large dome area here so if you have a larger head these are definitely going to fit you and like i said they were only like two dollars so why not pick up every color and i don't even think this was every color that they had these were just the neutral tones that i knew would go with everything that i got already so yeah, pick you up some hats for your bad hair days, but you can still look cute, okay? And last but not least, I did pick up some necklace sets because you just always gotta pick up some jewelry from Shein just to complete some looks. Nice little throwaway jewelry. They're usually like one to two dollars, so you're not gonna get much wear out of them, but <laughs> the one time that you do wear it, you're gonna be a hit, sis. But yeah. They're really, really sparkly. But that's it for today's haul. Let me know how you all enjoyed this haul. Have you gotten a start on your fall look yet? Are you gonna be shopping at Shein? Let me know down below in the comments. Talk to me, I'll talk back. I talk back, okay? <laughs> so 
so definitely go ahead and hit the thumbs up on this video if you liked it and i will see you glam dolls in my next video thanks for watching